Hello my friends and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to my Witcher 3 next generation playthrough on the PlayStation 5. We're playing on Death March difficulty and this will be part 5. Um, we're doing the Hearts of Stone DLC. The absolute amazing gem of a DLC this is. <laughs> Alright guys, what we're going to do in the last episodes we were doing the first half of um, Open Sesame. Um, it's a pretty long quest. So what we're going to do now, just before we go and meet the others at the Herbless Hut, um, I'd like to do this. Let me show you. Uh, where is it? Okay, it should be down here. I think it is. Oh, wait, 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 wait. It could be a treasure hunt. Um, do you remember that uh, thing we won um, at the auction? It was a statue and we dismantled it, etc., etc. This one, that's the one I want to do. A dark legacy. So this one here, <clears throat> let's have a look. Um, where are we on the map? Oh, that is far away. <laughs> oh, my God, that is far away. Now, there, there are other places to explore. I'm not going to do all that today, so don't worry. But I'd like to do this. Uh, guys, this is your second opportunity uh, to face an ancient lesion. Now, you remember I've got the ancient lesion decoction. And we had to... Uh, well, we, d we did a quest back in Skellige. This is in the main game. Uh, I can't remember what part it was, what episode. But I'll put it in the top right-hand corner. So this is way back. I can't remember. But... um. You know, check it out if you want to watch that episode. If you want to get the ancient Leshen mutagen, that would be your opportunity to do so. However, this is also another way you can get it. You can get it from this place because we have to fight a ancient Leshen. So we're going to do that. Now, I don't want to interfere with any of these quests. I think we'll fast travel to Erd and then we'll go down there. Anyway, where are we? So we're right, yeah, we're right next door to it. Oh, the music's turned off. I really hate that, guys, honestly. Um, anyway. Uh, by the way, check out the end of the video. If you watch all the way through, there's going to be some bonus material as well. So, anyway. Let's do this. Now, what is an ancient lesson again? Is it relict? It is. It's a, yes, relict. Okay, relict oil. All right, so let's go here. I'll just ignore everything else. I'm not going to find any other enemies. Uh, this can be difficult, but it, it'll be fine. You'll be okay. Now, you see this area here. Try not to interact with anything here because this will clash with um, another quest. Uh, I'm not going to do that yet. It's going to be in a later episode. So we can just ride through. Okay, some very suspicious That's people there. <laughs> That's a hint. Okay, so let's go. Why is the white dot telling me to go there specifically? Hey, Roach, Roach, please. Oh, hey, when she gets so stubborn like that. Okay, let's go this way. All right, let's do this. Just hope I don't, you know, bump into any fallen knights or anything like that. I don't think we will. No, don't back. Go turn, please, Roach, please. Thank you. All right, so down this way, I guess. Come on. I'll trot slowly, just in case I <laughs> land into a camp full of bandits. <laughs> a very spooky quest. It really is. But lots of treasure, so that's good. Lots of stuff to loot. All right. <laughs> that is bloody awesome. Okay, I'm going to go on for... Oh, what's this? I've never seen that before. From this road, there be no return. Yonder lies dead white wood. I've never seen this before. Now that is interesting. Look at that, ravens. Oh, lots of wolves. Okay, so beast oil and relic oil. Which one's a relic? That one. Okay. Alright, guys. Wish me luck. <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous. 
Now, shall I follow the white dots? Is it a particular path, or shall I go up here? Let me have a look. Let me just look around a bit. Why is it telling me to go a specific way? I don't understand. Gosh, it's so atmospheric here, man. It's really spooky. Okay. Anyway. Alright, let's go up. Let's just go up here. A climb. Come on, Geralt. Come on. Hidden treasure. Okay. Gosh, this is scary, guys. So there should be a signpost as well, if memory serves. There should be one. Yeah, there is. Here we go. This is awesome, man. <laughs> God damn. Like I keep saying in all my... There he is! He's seen me already. Okay. Whoa! He already lost any help. Whoa, he is powerful. Jesus! What the hell? God damn it! Oh man, this one's gonna be tough. Oh shit. Okay, switch uh, swords. Oh, uh, what? No, not him. What are you doing, girl? Jesus. Oh my god. Okay, 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 okay. I don't like this. <laughs> He's actually really tough, guys. Oh my god. Uh, why do I... Wait, 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 wait. I, I selected Dancing Star. Wow. Thanks, game. Thanks. Guys, you saw me. I'll check the footage back, but I did this. And I don't know why I have Moon Dust. Jesus. Oh, you piece of shit, Wolf. Oh, my God. Stop it. Jesus. He's almost as tough as the bloody Monster Hunter one. Actually, no, that's not true. Sorry, I'm talking rubbish. The Monster Hunter one was awful. I'm actually scared of him, guys. Why is he not taking that much damage? Okay, okay, okay. Okay, he's going to appear there. Oh, get out of here. <laughs> oh, that is doing... Wow, that is doing the Lord's work, guys. Look how much damage he took there. Oh, he thought he had me, didn't he? Okay. Oh, crap. Uh, guys, I reckon CDPR have definitely improved him. Because he was a lot easier than this. And those bloody ravens. I don't remember them. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Where are you? Where are you going up here? Wee. <laughs> oh, crap. Oh, you missed. How do you feel? <laughs> so I don't want to be too aggressive. He seems a lot tougher than I remember. Look at those crits. Oh, what? So what just happened? Okay. Oh, no reinforcements. Damn it. Oh, God. Okay, I need to switch swords. Ah, damn you. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, my God. Guys, he's, he's much, much more formidable. Okay, the wolves have left for now. No, they're coming back. God damn it. No, not him. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, Jesus. No, stop running away. Come back here. Oh my god, this is so awkward. Okay, good, good. He's on fire. Get him quick, quick, quick. No, uh, god damn it. Okay, oh, I've got no more. Okay. Wait, is he retreating? 
Uh, let me put, um, hang on a sec. Dragon's Dream. Please give me the right bomb. Okay. Why is he doing that? Oi, what are you doing? Why are you acting weird? Did I miss? Really? <laughs> Why is he walking away? Jesus. Oh, get out of there. Okay, let me just kill this last wolf. Okay, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. No, oh, get the sword out, man. I'm just going to take these hits, guys. Oh, God. Oh, whoa, Jesus. Okay, um, 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 help. <laughs> help me. <laughs> oh, damn it. I really panicked. <laughs> what did I get? That's the evilest thing. Okay, I, I don't know what that means, but I'll, ch I'll check later. God, I hate when he creeps up on you like that. Leave me alone, you're scaring me. Jesus. Okay. Oh, God, I hate you, wolves. Jesus. No, stop it. Okay, okay. Looks like they're all dead. Guys, he's really frightening me. Jesus. Oh, okay, it's over. Oh, did it. All right, I've got to give it up to CDPR. They've definitely improved him. Where's his loot? Okay, there we go. So we'll get the mutagen. Guys, that was awesome. I really enjoyed that. That was really, a really good fight. Um, He's never been this difficult. You can normally kill him, um, even if you enemy upscale him. He's very easy to kill, you know, but not, not anymore. God, hear those rules. But anyway, he's dead now. It's done. So that is where uh, your second and only other opportunity to get a Ancient Lesion Mutagen if you need it. And the decoction is awesome. It's pretty awesome. Um, I'm going to start using it again once uh, I get maybe a Griffin uh, Master Crafted. Uh, by the way, guys, that's coming soon. I'm going to uh, upgrade the uh, Griffin stuff I've got. Um, and we'll try our Signs build again. Uh, do I want to do this episode, though? No, no, no. no. We'll do it late, later on in an episode or two. God, all these dead walls, man. All right, anyway, let's uh, crack on. But loved it. That was a great fight. Really exciting. Very scary. Okay, here we go. Okay, this is part two. Where's part one? Right, Count Romilly's Journal, part two. Last page is torn from Count Romilly's Journal. A pox upon Anastasia von Bormann. A pox upon her whole ploughing house. I finally found a way to end this deadly little charade she's put on. The key to unravelling the riddle lay in a dusty old tome in my library. That little vipress was marked by Leshen. That is why the monster attacked my castle. There was only one way out of this situation. I snuck up while she slept and throttled her. Oh, bloody hell. <laughs> she didn't even manage to, uh, to pee. Now I can finally leave my castle walls, thank the gods. The monstrosity has skirted off into oblivion, along with our cursed child. That entire affair was a horrific error. I'm just glad the savings from previous missions are safely preserved in the castle treasury. I must recruit some mage. Perhaps that will ensure I avoid such incidents in the future. Okay. The secret two quests in one? I don't understand. I don't remember that, actually. Um, anyway, let's keep going. Hopefully there's no... Oh, great. There's more wolves. God damn it. Okay, let's get this sword out. All right, let's do it. Let's uh, clear the area, secure the area. Oh, they always back away when I'm whirling. Oh crap, here we go. <laughs> oh. God, they're so tanky, guys. See, it makes a huge difference when your adrenaline isn't that high. Uh, remember, I'm using Catacan Decoction, so that the Adrenaline Points will build up crit hit chance. Anyway, um, where is this? 
Oh, it's down here. No, it's not. There's a secret passageway. I've got to find it. I can't remember where it is. Oh, there it is. Okay. Now, is there anything else around here? I'm just having a look around first, and then we'll go downstairs. Okay, that's just a dead wolf. Um... No, don't think there's anything else here. No, I think we're good. Okay, let's um, let's just go down the stairs. There might be wraiths if I if I remember correctly. Gosh, what a spooky quest, guys! Oh, there's definitely going to be wraiths here. My God. Okay. I'm going to put some light. I'm scared. <laughs> Alright. Okay, we'll break that down in a second. Let's just have a look around here. Okay, so what's this? Okay. So like these. Just, just to bring a bit of life into the room. <laughs> Any more candles? Okay, there's a chest there. Okay, we'll grab that in a sec. Let's read this. Right, this is part one. <clears throat> okay, Count Romley's journal, part one. Entries in chronological order. Last few pages missing, torn out. This craft has proved even more profitable than I, I, I had in anticipated. Five of the last seven kidnappings ended in success. Only two of the lads had fathers too miserly, miserly, mi miserly? I've never heard of that, uh, to ransom their sons. Clearly was more offspring where those came from, so the calculating knaves deemed the captured snots expendable. Note for the future, demand a significantly smaller ransom from clients with more than one male heir. I send the lads after Anastasia von Bormann, the Lord of Zutzer Castle is a magnificently wealthy noble, and Anastasia is his only child. I smell a lucrative transaction. The lads returned with the client's daughter that very night. The girl is calm, apathetic even. Something strange is afoot in the castle's surroundings. Flocks of ravens perch in the trees bordering the courtyard. This morning, a new contingent flew in. Two serving maids have gone missing. Could my lads have been responsible? Or did those ravens peck them to death? Here a giant ink blot covers half the page. One of my grooms has died. From what the remaining servants recount, he was killed by tree roots that suddenly thrust straight out of the ground. My men are petrified. Wolves howl day and night in the land surrounding the estate. Leaving the castle walls means certain death. We have barricaded ourselves inside and live as if under siege. Luckily, we've ample supplies of food and water. Perhaps this is some kind of curse. Franz, the servant who led the unit that kidnapped Anastasia, has hanged himself. Bloody hell. Black magic is surely at work. I must search the castle library for some indication what this might be. So then obviously part two um, of the letter or the journal. Um... That's when they realise, oh crap, it's actually an ancient legend. Um, yeah, not to be messed with, man. That was a tough enemy. Jesus. All right, let's open this up. And is it in relation to that dark... Okay, we've done Secret Life of Count Romilly. Now, what about the other one, though? Is that interlinked? Is that how that works? No. Okay, here we go. All right, so let's go this way, I guess. Oh, there's definitely going to be wraiths. I know it. That's a hundred percent. Um, yeah, let's put it this way. <laughs> yep, knew it. <laughs> I knew it. Come to Papa. Hey, I was just one wraith. Oh no, we're fine. We're good. Do you know what? I can actually use my lantern. It's fine. We're good. Oh, I forgot I can't use bombs. Damn it. Oh, you... Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. I see how this is... 
This is going to go. Oh, bloody hell, leave me alone, Jesus. No, oh. Great, wonderful. Oh, God. Oh, that's so irritating. Oh, there's another one. Okay, 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 two died. Oh, stop it, stop dodging. Oh, my God. One, two, and here we go. Yo, I hate you. <laughs> I really hate you sometimes. I really do. Come on, go get him, please. Don't be a prick bastard. Oh my god, guys. Jesus. Oh my god, what is wrong with this one? Oh, you're so annoying. What's wrong with you? Okay, okay, I've got to bust out Yerdin. Come on, come into my trap. Oh, that's better. My God. Jesus, this one was so tricky. What an arsehole. <laughs> anyway, whatever. It's, it's done. It's over. Okay, fused dust. Good. Okay, and some more uh, dust as well. Is there anything else? What's this? <laughs> Dwarven spirit. Uh, okay, let's go this way. Oh, what's this? Ransom letter. Check it out. To the Right Honourable Raphael von Bormann, Lord of Zutzer Castle, we wish to reassure you, my dear sir, that your daughter is in the flower of good health. She will continue to enjoy said health, provided her father acts according to our instructions. They are as follows. In six days, at the exact stroke of midnight, you, sir, <laughs> are about are to present yourself in person outside the cursed chapel near Brunich in order to hand over a ransom in the amount of 1,000 unshaven Nova Grand uh, crowns. You are to sound no alarm and come alone with no guards or retainers of any sort. I trust we needn't um, add that any failure to follow these instructions will result in an immediate and pro proportionate decline in the young and beautiful Lady Borman's health. My best wishes to you, sir. <laughs> well, well, wow, that's the most pol politest bandit I've ever, ever, ever heard of. Right, um, so we go here. Let me light this. I don't think there's any more enemies. I think we should be good. Oh, gosh. Is that her? Anastasia? That's horrible. <laughs> anyway, I think that's it, guys. We're done. Is that all? Wow, I thought we'd get, like, coins. Oh, sorry about that, guys. <laughs> it's a bit underwhelming in the end. But hey, look, we we had a great fight, which I'm, you know, very happy about, actually. But, um... No, there's nothing else. I think that's it. All right, fine. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, guys, so what we're going to do now... We're going to do the, um... The rest of Open Sesame... No, not that. I don't want that. Okay, so we need to go to the Herbalist Hut. How far away are we from there? If we can go there by... Via Roach. Now, let me think. Are we going to have any fights? Can I use... Well, we, sorry. We are going to have a lot of fights, but... Do I need decoctions? Okay, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. So, um... Okay, there's quite a long trek. Let's just fast travel, guys. Let's just get there. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. Sorry, I was going to put it on pause so I can sell some of my equipment, uh, swords and armor pieces, etc. And I was going to get a new haircut for Geralt because we're going to be wearing a new outfit. I'll tell you what, I'll see you guys in a bit. Uh, we'll be near the Herbalist Hut when, when we're done. So I'll see you very, so uh, very soon. Hello, my friends. I'm back and Geralt looks great. <laughs> so we're going to go for the uh, shaved back and sides, ponytail, etc. Because we're going to have um, a new outfit for this particular quest. Um, okay, what we'll do is uh, I have to go to the Herbalist Heart. It should be near Novigrad. It should be. So, um, okay, yeah, we'll just go there and further. we'll get a roach. All right, just following the white dots. <laughs> Actually, where is it telling me to go? Oh, we can go here. That's bullshit. We can go there. 
Oh, it's far. God damn it. I didn't realize. And this is taking me the long way. No way, man. This is a better route. If we go here. So let me ignore the white dots. Let's go this way. We'll go through that oxen fur gateway. Oh, what happened to the puffins, guys? I really miss them. Oh, listen, I'm not, no, I'm not gonna, uh, it's gonna make me upset. If I start thinking about the, the olden days. <laughs> oh, I miss, I miss all of the other characters though, guys, you know. You know, as much as I love and adore the DLCs, it's, you gotta remember, that's where we first started, you know, it's where it all began. You know, Siri, you know, Vesemir, rest in peace. Um, you know, the whole gang, it's just... They're just not here anymore. It's, it's, it's quite upsetting. <laughs> All right, here we go. So let's grab Roach. Okay, so let's go this way. A beautiful day in the game. It's raining a lot here where I'm living. <laughs> so not a beautiful day outside, but in the game, lovely jubbly. I'm getting a bit lost. This way? Oh. What is he guarding? Why is there a Danish soldier here anyway? Huh? Sorry guys, just quick distraction. That's just random. Why would there be a Redanian soldier there? That's a bit weird. Okay, clothes. Oh, I don't know. Whatever. Yeah, there's nothing here. Whatever. Let's get out of here. Okay. Right, Come let's on. go this way. Oh, for God's sake. I hate these dots. All right, let's go. Oh, this is lovely, guys. This is so beautiful. See, this is one of the advantages of having... What's that? What is that? Oh, go, drowners. Go. No, thank you. Goodbye. Not worth my time. I just had a, a, a titanic battle with an ancient legend. A worthy opponent. I have no time for these, these blue skins, evil drowners. Hey! Whoa. Oh, Roach, no! No, please. Oh, my God. Okay. Now will you go? Thank you. All right. Yeah, it's, it's so lovely. It's uh, having my TV on my desk. Um, it really boosts the immersion. You, you guys should try it, you know? I mean, listen, if it's <laughs> if it's a ginormous TV, I wouldn't recommend it. It might be a bit too... You might... Well, we might have to sit very close... Sorry, away from it. Why? What the hell? All these ravens just appeared out of this one spot. It might be a bug. Anyway, whatever. Let's go here. I still need to do this race. The Vagal Buds race. I still need to do the Crow's Perch race, guys. Jesus. Oh, God. Look, in good time, I promise I'll sort it out at some point. I will sort it out. It's just so much to do, you know? So much to do in this game. No one around. No one spoils it. <laughs> My lovely ride. Through the sunshine. I just hope um, I don't run into any knights or... Or wyverns. You know, there's like high-level wyverns that fly about as well. Okay, surely we're getting closer, right? Alright, it's telling me to go here now. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, wolves. No, not interested. Sorry, wolves. Leave me alone. Got no time for you. Stay away from me. Over here. All right, guys. Nothing to loot. Except for this. Yeah, nothing special. Anyway, let's uh, get in there. Where's the entrance? Okay, here we go. 
All right. Hello, mate. <laughs> okay, guys. How's oh, nothing else to loot? Okay. And Countess Yvonne of Lanexeter's necklace. Your handiwork, wasn't it? It was. I scaled a gutter, entered her bedchamber. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. Ah, at last, we're all here. Time to begin. This heist is no jest. So if any of you has any doubts, isn't sure, now's the time to leave. Won't be able to after. For Sodi's auction house, it's vault. That's our target. Everline, you'll enter through the tower when the patrol rounds this corner. Drop us a line. We have to be inside within five minutes, is that enough? It's plenty. Splendid. Once we're all in the tower, we'll proceed to the auction house. Shouldn't see any guards inside. If we do, we'll have Geralt and his brothers. Then, downstairs to the vault. Quinto will crack the lock. We get in the vault, take the loot, disappear out the back through a secret passage. I've said my piece. Any questions? Hmm. All good and fine, except... What if something goes wrong? Seriously, you're on your own. We all are. Just like that? No room for friendship in this business. Additional security measures. Traps. Any inside? Anything we need to watch out for? Nothing particularly dangerous. Here on the ground floor, there's a rope linked to the bell in the tower. Anyone sounds the alarm, there'll be trouble. How do we stop it from ringing? Don't pull the rope. As I said, the auction house ought to be empty. I don't expect any problems. What about the vault? How is it secured? With a door. But you ought to be able to handle it. Any other problems, we resolve as they come. Anything else? Got a horse sense take on this. Secret passage. If we plan to use it on the way out, why not on the way in? Excellent question. Why not? Every corridor has two ends, right? Like a rope. I know the location of just one end. It's in the vault. The other, it's somewhere beneath the city. But I can't tell you where. Mm -hmm. Great. But if you were to... Find that location, I wouldn't need any of you. Believe you me, I've tried. Time and again. Anything else? All right, let's get to work. I want to be done with this as soon as possible. We'll reconvene in the gateway beside the tower. Midnight sharp. And everyone's to make sure they're not followed. I'll get word to the cook in the barracks. What about wearing masks? Not a city in the north that don't have wanted posters with my likeness hanging about. I'll tend to that. Ah, one last thing. Inform the city watch. Blabber anything about this over your nail. And I'll kill you. With the old man. Um, do I need to look, guys? I'm not sure. I think I have to prepare. You know what? No, 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 never mind. Let's just go there now. It's fine. If you're so damn scared, somebody will talk. Let's all go there together now. Any objections? Anyone need more time? On our way, then. <laughs> this is so badass. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> Oh, damn, I can't wear my, my shades. Damn it. Let's begin. Prime. Just one patrol. Mixture of yours must have worked. Eveline, you ready? Are you kidding? Of course I am. Three. Two, one. It's clear. On your way. Wow, look at her go. <laughs> Jesus. It's like not Peter Parker. <laughs> City foul, shy all over again. <laughs> this is so awesome. Shh. 
shit. Uh oh. Wow, that was awesome, guys. If memory serves, you assured us there'd be no one inside. Seems my informer was wrong. Is that all you've got to say? <sighs> I nearly broke my neck. You knew what you were signing up for. This is no time to argue. We'll argue later. You can be sure of that. Agreed. Pass point and no return. Uh, let's do that. <laughs> Not the time, true. But we'll discuss this later. You can be sure of that. At your service. Mate. You're not my mate. Shut One up. One guard could mean many more. <laughs> You'd best draw your sword now. No. What now? No one dies. Said so from the start. Oh, crappy wooden swords. Great. <laughs> Thanks, Geralt. <laughs> oh, she's so sexy. I love her. <laughs> Whatever. Don your masks <laughs> and let's go. Right, these are pretty cool. Wait, where's mine? Okay. All right, we're not going to leave yet. Um, there's some stuff to loot here. Um, and not only that, there's something to read here. So there's a ladder up there, etc. So let me let me go around. Or me trying it, always good. Ah, Caesar lamp, why not? Oh, and let me check my decoctions and stuff. Um, the thing is, I don't think we'll need them. I'm not sure, guys. Oh, uh, put some hangman's venom on your... I know it's a crappy wooden sword, but, you know, use that anyway. Now, what about this? I'll tell you what, when the time comes, I'll, I'll take some decoctions. Okay, look at these paintings. And, whoa, that, is, that scared me. I actually thought I was a person. <laughs> okay, give me a second. So grab that, grab that, and check this out, guys. Letters must be old. String seems to say so, too. A love letter. I wonder who this is from. Annotation uh, item acquired with the rest of the Von E estate. Obviously, Von Everett. Put up for auction. Starting price, one crown. No bids. Jesus. My love, don't give up. There's still a week till you're to wed the Afiri. I'll think of something. Perhaps I'll get the coin by then. Perhaps my tears will convince your father. Perhaps the gods will hear our prayers. Or, if not they, perhaps some devil will. Jesus. <laughs> If nothing else helps, I'll crash into the temple, through the window, and swoop you up from the altar. We'll flee somewhere far, far away, to the edge of the world, where no one will find us. You write of sadness. I feel its weight too. I think of you constantly, of how we sat at the alchemy till dawn nursing a bottle of wine, and you traced our dream house in the sawdust on the floor, of how we dangled our feet in the water from the dock, and you sang those bawdy songs and made me laugh and laugh. I kissed a medallion carrying your portrait before I fall asleep and as soon as I wake. I swear on all that is holy, we shall be together forever. Be brave, I love you, your O. Ah, oh, guys, I'm not going to lie, that got me a bit emotional, man. That is sad. That That's true love, man. Anyway... You don't need to be a rocket scientist to realise this is obviously Olgid. It was true love. Quite right, Geralt. Quite right. But anyway, we'll see. I won't spoil it, but we'll see how the story unfolds. Let's go up this ladder real quick. Thank you guys for patiently waiting while I <laughs> do all of this. Probably wondering, what the hell's, what the hell's going on? Don't we want to do this heist or what? Okay, is there anything else? Yeah, just one more thing here. I don't think it's anything important, but hey, might as well. Hey, hey, no, get up there. Geralt, please. Stop being awkward. Come on. 
well, all that for hey, it's a silver, it's a sorry, a meteorite ingot. It's always worth it, you know. All right, let's go. Put this away. <laughs> Don't want to reveal our position. <laughs> Clear for now. Knock on wood. Good. Eyes in the back of your heads, everyone. Mine are open. I've already seen several things I'd gladly take with me. Not now. The vault. That's our target. Is that clear? Calm down, dude. What now, wolf? <laughs> Dickhead. <laughs> yes, but we shall raise the starting point. Watch this. Guards! Guards! Should have stayed in that cage. You said. I damn well know what I said. <sighs> Useless. Before they sound the alarm. He's a, he's an incompetent. Oh crap! Okay, um, I uh, don't know what to do. No, you know what? Let's take our buffs. Okay, I've already done this just in case I haven't, and let's do that, that, and I still got bloody north um, uh, moon dust. Let's put northern wind. Oh wait, while well, they're frozen. <laughs> Is this actually damaging them? Oh, come on. Really? Oh, my God. It's going to take forever. Oh, my God. Really? Stop missing. Oh, I know what the problem is, guys. I'm used to um, having, you know, that special ability on my sword. The enchantment. Um, severance. So I can't reach them. They're so far away. <laughs> Jesus. Hey! Look who it is. The cocksucker. Hey, he's killing them. I thought he said no killing. Stop him! He's not to flee! Oh, go, Geralt. Ah, shite. Great. Dude. Didn't have to kill him. Jesus. Lock themselves in. Bollocks! <laughs> Damn it. Lay down your arms! You have no chance! Perhaps not. <laughs> But we do have hostages. Mercy, master! On the count of three, we go in. One, two! Ah! Come one step closer and folk will die. Hold now! We must negotiate. What are your demands? To release the hostages? Buy us a bit of time, Geralt. Okay. We have one demand. Pull back from the auction house. You know I cannot do that. You can. Just not sure you want to. How about I help you decide and kill a hostage? Just do what they want. I beg you. <laughs> Calm yourself. No one is to be harmed. Clear? Nothing simpler. So long as you take your boys and pull out, we'll all live happily ever after. I repeat. That is not an option. We must bargain, reach an agreement. <laughs> so tell me a joke, any joke, so long as it's funny. Excuse me? This is not- Got a tip for you. No charge. Every tip after this will cost you in the blood of an innocent. When talking to someone who's holding hostages, never use the words no, not, but, or maybe. Understand, Reginald? My name's not Reg. <laughs> <laughs> You're not supposed to say not! <laughs> huh, see that? This one gets the idea. And if I want to call you Reginald, I'll call you Reginald. Clear? Yes. Clear. Excellent. So let me hear the joke, Reginald. And believe me, you better hope it makes me laugh. Uh, a, li a little elfin runs up to, to his mother, calling... Poop, poop. 
She says, it's over there, love. Cut yourself a slice. <laughs> oh, God. Um, let's see that. <laughs> you a racist, Reginald? No, not at all. I just... Ah! <laughs> Don't say no! <laughs> yes, yes, I'm a racist. I really hate elves. Dwarves, too. <laughs> Time he took a gander downstairs. Vaults open. <laughs> oh, my God. That was great. Give you another chance, Reginald. You got ten minutes to think of a better joke. Don't fuck this up. Goodwill gesture now. Let one hostage go, then another hostage for every joke you tell me. Deal? I hate elves. Deal. That's Ten dwarfs minutes. too. Oh, I can't breathe, guys. Oh, Good dear. Work. Sorry, boys. You'll have to go on without me. No, oh, don't leave. I didn't sign on for this turn of events. Just one way out of here. Through the vault. There's a second. The chimney. I believe I'll squeeze through. Doubt you can, Witcher. You've no choice, I'm afraid. Let's go. Downstairs. Bye, my dear Eveline. Where is she? Still there? No, she's gone. God damn it. <laughs> it's nice knowing you. <laughs> anyway, let's um go down here. There's a few things to read. Um as well. Anyway. Okay, I don't want to miss anything. There's some law uh, law stuff here as well. Okay, there's no treasures here. I don't think. Hey, oh, for God's sake, Carol. Really? Nothing there either. Wow, CDPR really stripped bare most of these, um, these chests. You know, they're full of goodies everywhere. Anyway, whatever. All right, let's keep going up this way. Anything here? Oh, for God's sake. Okay. Let's try it this way. I saw there's a, a red thing there flagging. I'll pick it up in a second. Okay. I think we should be good for now. Alright, let's check this out. List of objects in need of restoration. Okay, in preparation for the upcoming auction, I hereby certify the receipt of the following items entrusted to me for restoration. Elvin Porphyritic <laughs> statue of Aileron, sculpted by an unknown master. Um, lady draped with hung fox, oil painting from the atelier of Master Van Danube. Jadet, I think that says Jadet, sorry, statuette of a goose girl and seven accompanying geese figurines. Pipe carved of cherry wood with a, ceram uh, a ceramic stem, uh, certified to have belonged to Nina Fira, Fira Vanti. Pinewood trunk ornamented with brass elements crafted by the workshop of Samson of Barnard. A painting. All right, check this out, guys. Ready? A painting by Van Rowe. Remember that mysterious painter? The pseudonym associated with the work of Lady Iris von Everick. Just remember that, yeah? So that's basically a pseudonym. She, you know, it's like an, um, she doesn't want to be known uh, as, you know, painter Lady von Everick. She wants to be Van Rowe. Han Van Meer Geren. Anyway, whatever. So anything that's been painted by Van Rowe is actually laid Iris Von Everick. Anyway. Okay, see if we can stumble upon other things to flesh out the story a bit. Hey, stop getting stuck. They're just books, Carol. God damn you. Who's that by again? That's a Van Rowe painting. So that's, um, okay, there's something to loot there. Just give me a sec. Just clear this out. Right, here we go. Check it out. Right, um, <clears throat> excuse me. Request for payment. This document certifies that my principal, Emmett Lumendorf and Sons, 
Co. registered in Tretagor, power of my attorney forms attached, has authorised my office to make payment for services rendered, namely the forging and installation of doubly fortified and armoured doors fitted with Colossus brand locks for the vaults of the Basodi Bus uh, Brothers Auction House in Oxford. This document likewise uh, constitutes a request for the payment in the amount of 65,000 Novigrad crowns within two weeks of its receipt. If at the conclusion of said period no payment has been made, collection procedures will be initiated in the proper judicious the uh, ju judicial <laughs> channels robert hilbert esquire okay so that's paying for those <laughs> massive doors that um can't remember his name horst is hiding behind all right got one more piece there to read oh my god i've got like fifty thousand horse whistler books jesus all right check this out guys letter from master matthew now just very quickly do you remember why um do you remember i told you that horse basodi was acting like he was just spazzing out at Geralt? this is why dear master basodi i write to you concerning a most atypical matter but please do not dismiss it summarily for both you and the institution you run are in great danger allow me to explain what i mean it so happens i re i am a renowned astrologist and teller of fortunes in recent days, for evident reasons, I have been forced into hiding, but a small circle of loyal customers has, has been kept informed of my whereabouts. One of these customers is a lady of high birth. Her name I shall not disclose out of discretion. Said lady came to me with a request. She wanted to learn what price would be certain items, uh, would certain items uh, would sell for at an upcoming auction. After voicing my many objections, I nevertheless relented to the lady's request. But before you take offence at this interference in your business, please read to the end. For the cards I laid out for this lady told me something very important. The constellation of the cards clearly indicated a wolf shall appear at your doorstep, and you shall not let him enter, but he shall nevertheless find a way inside. He shall enter your house, then take your house from you. <laughs> I love this. I saw a tower struck by lightning and blood drinking blood. Remember that beer? I believe you are extremely aware what that signifies. Am I not right? As a fair reward for this warning, please hand a sum of 2,000 crowns to the man delivering this message. My sincerest respects, Master Matthew. So you do get that, guys, a wolf, etc., etc. The blood-drinking blood thing that will become apparent very shortly. But that is crazy. So that's why... Um, so if you miss all of this, you won't know why Horse was getting so angry at Geralt. He panicked. He was like, oh, shit, that um, mage was actually right, you know. <laughs> oh, hang on a minute. Something's going to happen here. Oh, where's my sword? I don't want a wooden sword for this. Oh my god, I'm gonna... Oh, okay, you'll... Well, wish me luck, guys. But, um... Oh, I've got my swords back. And my crossbow. Okay, then. The lock. Lovingly crafted. Two spring-loaded bolts, cylindrical plugs, dameritian wards. I'm not interested. No one's interested. We go in. Geralt, you're at the fore. Why me? It's why I hired you. Now move. With no time. Do or die. We got this, Geralt. I think. <laughs> I think. Okay, let me just oil up my sword. Because we've got some very nasty enemies awaiting us downstairs. <laughs> Alright. Here we go. Uh, yeah, I've tried to jump over this, guys. It, yeah, it's never worked. I always fall in there. Shit. As if I Oh, get off me! No, get off me! Oh, no! Whoa! 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 Okay, 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 that's enough. That's enough. Oh, damn it, guys! Get him! Get him! Get him! Get him! Come on! Please! Oh, shit, I'll run out of stamina. <laughs> okay, let me take that. Bloody hell! Oh, you piece of shit! Will you stop it? <laughs> He's such an arsehole. 
<laughs> get him, get him, please. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> oh, you piece of shit. I don't want to use a bomb on him. Okay, I tell you what, I'm going to trick him. Oh, it worked. Oh, nice. Okay, I'm going to pretend I'm backing away from him. See? And why did that not work, though? All right, he's dead. It's all over, guys. Jesus Christ. That's it. <laughs> what a piece of shit, that one. <laughs> Arsehole spider. Anyway, he's dead. Okie dokie. Right, now, what is in here? I think we can loot... Oh, can we not? I think we can loot stuff here. We can, we can, sorry. Um, guys, loot everything. Absolutely everything. Especially gold. You're going to need it if you want to do various enchantments. What's that? Hey, get in there. There's a ship in there. All right, this is a... Paintings were on the block. Okay, can you hear those guards? Don't worry about them. They're not going to break in or anything. Just... Well, not take your time. You want to get through this um, fairly good time. But don't miss anything. There's a lot of um, valuable stuff here. And then we can go through that gate. So, yeah. This is a heist, after all. <laughs> be a bit pointless not to, you know, to actually walk out there with no treasure. That would be a bit dumb. Okay. Shut up, dude. No, you are. Oh, come on, really? It's just alcohol? Come on, give me some gold. Oh my god, that was worthless. Okay, that's all looted here. There's going to be more loot coming, but um, let's sort this out first. You don't know who you're fucking with. On the contrary, I know all too well. Yeah. You old? Greetings, brother. Been years. Well, well. Complications, complications. Um. Right. Should have known. Same eyes, same double chin, same rotten heart. Just, Just have a double question. chin. This family reunion? What's the point? Revenge. For betrayal, years of poverty, humiliation. Father left the auction house to me in his will. Horst cheated me, had me disinherited. Anything, everything we earned, you squandered on cards and whores. Father didn't see that, I did. That's no excuse, Horst. And it won't save your life. You two, stand with me. I'll not let the Redanians lay a hand on you, give you whatever you want. Okay, guys, up to you. I've tried all variations, uh, anything you can think of. Um, they're all a lot of fun. They are. But um, I'm going to keep this simple. <laughs> Let me just... Okay, can't bribe me. I'm going to stick to you all. Now, the thing is, I can't remember, but I don't know if, um, you know, the dude behind me is going to join the other guy. I can't remember. But anyway. A desperate attempt at bribery going once, twice, thrice... Hmm. No takers, no sale. Speak for yourself. Yeah, I knew it. Piece of shit. You'll pay for that, Quinto. With your head. At them! Okay. Oh, it's right next to me. Jesus. <laughs> I better roll away. Okay, let me just put some hangmans. Uh, anything else that'll help? Ah, no, we're good. We're good. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Go after, <laughs> go after you. Old. Oh, that's so funny. They just like, they're just attacking him, guys. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Oh, uh, what? Hey. Oh. I'd have preferred to resolve this elsewise. Stolen the scrolls, thrown you out into the street. Revenge is best served cold, after all. But I don't mind serving it hot. No. I beg you, mercy for your brother. I shall do anything you ask. Truly. 
Anything. Anything! Sign over to me. Walk out as you stand, with just the clothing on your back. Allow me one thing, any one thing. Fifteen years. In the sewers. Like a beast, and you the cheek. To plead? Jesus. Oh, that is gruesome. Oh, God, he looks awful. God damn it. Take that. Blood drinking blood. Do you get it now, guys? <laughs> I'm only talking to new players, obviously. Gosh, he's just as bad, though. Oh my god! <laughs> oh dear. Satisfied? Exceptionally. You? Not really. No, and I won't be until I find Max Brasotti's house. In this vault, or so you said. And it is. There. But I fear it's not yours for the taking. You see, it houses my father's will. A scroll thanks to which Ewald Borsoldi, long missing, will assume the family fortune. And Geralt of Rivia, who you cheated, what'll he assume? Alas, but he's free to choose anything else. Don't provoke me. Never know. Might choose to take your head. You're wounded. Tired. Figure my chances are good. Oh, God's sake. Why do they think they have a chance against a bloody witcher? They're so dumb. Honestly, I don't get it, guys. Anyway, this is not a bust. We can figure this out. No, we're going to kill him. Dumb decision, but have it your way, mofo. <laughs> hmm. Dumb, but have it your way. Let's make this quick before the soldiers get down here. As I said... At your service, mate. And as I said, you're not my mate, you prick. You know what? Let's give you a bit of Axie as well. <laughs> uh, what? It did work. Uh, guys, is he immune to Axie or something? <laughs> what? That's weird. All right, fine. We'll do the old-fashioned way. I'll just parry you to death. <laughs> take that. Take that. Take that. <laughs> he lost his legs. <laughs> Lovely jubbly. <laughs> that is awesome. Oh, poor guy. I actually feel sorry for him now. <laughs> anyway. Right, uh, guys, take your time in here. Just loot everything. Where's the loot? Uh, what? Okay, I was getting worried there for a sec. God damn it. Yennefer would definitely like this. <laughs> anyway. All right, let's loot up everything. Look at that wolf, guys. That's awesome. All right, I need to get to those boxes, but give me a sec. A fairy crossbow. Is this any good? Uh, no, no. If Okay, if I didn't make up the uh, sign or feline crossbow, then I would say that was pretty good. All right, let's, uh, yeah. Just grab everything you can. Oh, crap. Some more stuff here. A vial, really? Oh, come on, that is so awkward to get to, really? Oh, no, come on, don't say I can't. It's probably just a vial anyway. Oh, that takes a piss. <laughs> CDPR, you assholes. All right, fine, whatever, I don't want it anyway. Oh, uh, no, Geralt, oh, God, what's happening? Jesus. Right, let's get out of here, I'm scared. <laughs> but what I mean by that is, um, I'm scared it might uh, bug out and crash. Oh, God, Geralt, please. <laughs> God damn. Alright, grab all of that. That is awesome loot. You're not going to come back here, guys, so just just take everything, you know? Alright, is there anything else? Okay, this side is secure. Now, what about here? Okay, we sell all of that. We'll break it down. 
Uh, by the way, I have to also look for the secret, um, does Lucky Leap, no, 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 Geralt, please leave the candles alone, I beg you. Oh, for God's sake, fire, really? Okay. Oh, God, I gotta, I gotta get a close-up of this. Oh, no, pressing wrong buttons, one second. Oh, God, sorry, I messed up there, okay. Let's go around this side. <laughs> Jesus, guys. <laughs> what a way to go. My God. Anyway. Okay, I'll grab that in a sec. That's a oh, here we are. Viper Venomous Steel Sword. So if you want to make this up, it is worth it. But just bear in mind, um, you can't take it to Grandmaster level. So it is an, it's kind of like an extra expense. But make it if you've never made it before. Because it is bloody excellent. <laughs> well said, Geralt. <laughs> Redanians will be here soon. Damn it, secret passage. Where is it? All right, we've got to find it now. Now there should be a lever. One of the here we are. I found it straight away. It's this. Nick of time. Now to get out of here. Yeah, I don't see any other treasures, so I think we're good. Yeah, that's it. Nothing else here. Okay. Wait, am I not wearing shades? Come on, guys. We've got to do this in style. Come on, man. <laughs> That's better. Very stylish. Okay. There might be some loot here as well, so just keep a lookout. Yeah, the reason I wanted to kill both of them... Um, look, you don't have to. You can actually spare uh, the other dude. And just take the house, but not the contents. But I hate both of them, guys. They're, they're both knobs. <laughs> Is there no loot here? I thought there was. Alright, fine. Oh, here we are. This is what I was on about. Okay, so that's not bad. No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 Geralt, please. Okay, very slowly. Oh, why? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Okay, don't mind if I do. Anything else? No, I think we're good. Okay, just simply... Oh. Alright, we just simply leave. <laughs> Those shades are badass, man. Alright. Okay, we're out. <clears throat> Take Maximilian Borsodi's house to Olgid. No, not the candles! You just said... Oh, come on. You acknowledge damn candles and you're still... Oh. Alright, here we go. I've been up here. There's nothing really here. It's just... It's just nothing. It's just an empty room. Alright, let's... Um, keep going this way. Where am I? I'm a bit disorientated. Oh, I don't know. I can't remember. <laughs> okay, let's just follow the white dots. Wakey, wakey. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Yeah, I know we were. So the alchemy is just there. But I love Lair, man. That was sad. It was, it was really painful to read that. Imagine, it's, look, you know, your partner, um, whoever you're married to, or, or you can't marry that person because that person's going to, or being forced to marry someone else. Can you imagine that, that pain, that separation? It's, it's awful. I, wow. I can only imagine. No stranger to the bottle, eh? Guests, fish, and bloomers. All stick after three days. <laughs> okay. Hey! <laughs> hey! <laughs> Alright. Okay, here we go, guys. Let's talk to... What's-his-face, Olgid. Gosh, he's been sitting there for like two weeks. Need to chat. I'm all ears, Witcher. Uh, we've exhausted his dialogue. Okay, here we go. Got something for you. I love gifts, but I prefer to unwrap them in private. Oi, lads, mind the barrels. Going out for a jabber with Geralt. Come. Oh, that's better. All right, what do you have for me? 
Max Persodi's house, as requested. Ah, Horst must be livid. He's not. No? He's not anything except dead. His brother, same thing. A few others, too. Stones you've got. But I didn't think you'd have the stomach for a massacre. <laughs> you underestimate me. Um, I don't want to sound like Anakin. I'll just say I had no choice. Situation got out of hand. <laughs> oh, sounds familiar. There you are, drinking, puffing on Henbane, and then, surprise, heads rolling across the floor. I don't know how or why. I'm not amused. No. Why not? Because unlike you, killing gives me no pleasure. The boss orders aren't worth your tears. Sons of bitches to a man. Why did you need those papers? To sink the boss orders, naturally. You see, I learned of an interesting clause in old man Maximilian's will. It states that his sons must meet and shake hands in agreement at least once a year at Bellatay. Failing that, the auction house must be auctioned off. The proceeds to go to Bill Maria's hospital. Guess the old man sensed what might happen. Horst and Yule are gnawing on soil now. But thanks to these papers, their relatives won't get the auction house. Family's lost it for good. And the hospital will have the funds it needs to treat orphans and beggars pro bono. Awfully noble of you, showing so much concern for the needy. I couldn't give a rat's ass about the needy. Made her wither and disappear along with the city. I wanted one thing. Revenge. Oh wait, where's the... Uh, what? Uh, there was some dialogue below that, it's gone. Alright, whatever. <laughs> whatever. The Borsodis. What's your gripe? Get kicked out of an auction? Worse. They evicted me from a home. Are you really interested? <laughs> no, not really. <laughs> no, of course we're, we're very interested. Wouldn't have asked if I wasn't. Ha! <laughs> Cheeky as ever. My family. They took on some debt. A poor investment in a sawmill. A bad crop one year. A lawsuit lost. You know how it is. When it rains, it pours. We needed but a few weeks to recover. But Horst Borsodi had acquired our debt. All of it. Demanded it be repaid immediately. I pleaded. I begged. I tore open my shirt at his threshold. Ugh. It was like talking to a wall. I went to the auction. Saw those perfumed pricks by my father's sword. My mother's death mask. My brother's horse tack. Ah, Horst earned a pretty pile selling our mementos. No surprise the animosity you feel for him. That was but the start. My Iris's parents learned of my family's misfortune. And our betrothal was no more. They found her another suitor. One from beyond the sea. The anger I felt. I thought I'd gone mad. Went to the tavern, drank around, a second, a broad, then had another tank. And then, then, I asked the wrong bloke for help. <laughs> Finish up, come on Geralt, man, no, no, no. Um, pretty sad story, what happened then? I don't remember, does he say anything else? What happened then? Uh, what happened then, Witcher? was one big stinking pile of shite. Nah, he doesn't say anything else. Well, why do you stand there? Do you need something still? Yeah, that was... Guys, if you know anything about that dialogue that went missing... Oh man, that's sad. I wanted to, you know, flesh it out a bit more, but it disappeared. So I don't know what I did wrong there. But anyway, if you know, please let me know uh, in the comments. I'd really appreciate it. Um, third task. Tell me about it, bitch. <laughs> I'm joking. <laughs> third wish. Time you stated it. A moment, Geralt. 
I will see to something. Then we'll chat. You there. Yank the herring out the barrel. Oh, God. <laughs> Now, ready to listen? Or do you still not give two shites about what I've got to say? I'm ready. I'm listening. Good. You'll return to your lord and tell him as follows. His demand was brazen. Hurt me to the core. For I was brought up to respect the sacred law of hospitality. And I shall not bend to an uncouth boar's dictum. Understood. I will pay him a visit shortly to test his willingness to adapt. So you ride off and announce me. And don't spare your horse. Got it? Aye, oh, got it. Give this man a mount and leave him go. Come with you. We must talk outside. The Afiri believe one should only discuss important matters out of doors with the gods as witnesses. <laughs> yeah, that's a very good question. Why are we keeping that man in a barrel? Barrel? What was that about? On the way here, we stopped for nourishment at a tavern belonging to one Lord Dauntless. We enjoyed ourselves as one does, isn't it? Raucously. Our antics were not to the liking of this Dauntless. Sent a man to warn us that if we were ever to return, we would hang. You burned the inn down? I left ample compensation with the innkeep. But it seems the rapscallion neglected to mention this to his lord. But that's of little import. What matters is someone called me a horse and threatened to kill me. It was one of those threats that sound like an invitation. I intend to accept it. Return to those parts. Gosh, you know what? In a fight, I would love Olgir to be part of my crew. <laughs> right, you'll get what's coming to you one day. Okay, fine, whatever. Must have made quite a few enemies along the way. Maybe not today and not tomorrow, but someday, someone will find a way to take you down. And that should trouble me why. I feel no fear, no regret. The wise men of Oxenford claim there are no gods. After death, there is only the void. I've known this void already. Death holds no surprises. Okay, third task, let's talk about it. Fulfilled two of your wishes. Time I learned the third. Confident, aren't you? Proud, sure of your strengths. Fearless. Third task, if you don't mind. Mutations. They stripped you of emotion. Tell me, have you ever loved? I mean, truly loved? Yes, it's Yennefer. Done. <laughs> yeah, I've loved. Can we get to the matter at hand? Perhaps instead we ought to sit down inside. Have a good chat over some fiery water. I don't want to drink with you. No, once it's over, once the job's done. We'll drink once the job's done. Afraid that's impossible. Succeed, and that's the end of me. Fail, and you'll not be back. Third wish. Still waiting to hear it. Why? Aren't you stubborn? <laughs> Fine. Listen well. I had a wife once. The day I saw her last, I gave her a rose. A violet one. Bring me that bloom. Wouldn't mind reminding myself what it looks like. <sighs> when was that? How long's it been? Flowers wilted and turned to dust by now. You wished to hear a wish. Now you have. Fulfill it. I ride now to visit this dauntless. But one of my men will remain here. He'll know how to find me. That is, of course, should you succeed. At least you could tell me where your wife is. In my old manor, east of Martin Foy's farmstead. I'd wish you Godspeed, but, well, 
You understand, I'm sure. Goodbye, Geralt. All right. What a night. <laughs> it's now 3 a.m. So we took part in a badass heist. We killed both brothers. We managed to get the house. Now, as you heard, <clears throat> the contents of that... Uh, well, if uh, both brothers don't meet up or whatever, the auction house will be... All the proceeds will be sold to charity. Um, but unfortunately, as you'll find out later on, Vivaldi will actually t take over that auction house because both brothers are dead. And that is very disappointing. I was hoping that obviously the kids would get the, um, you know, the proceeds, but it didn't happen. Anyway, what's this? Let it be known that the Oxenfurt sewers have been closed until further notice. Signed, Colonel Albrecht Hockenhole, <laughs> Redanian Army 2nd Range Infantry Division. So we can't go back there if we wanted to. <laughs> Yeah, that was awesome, guys. Like I said, honestly, the um, this whole DLC is amazing. But the Open, Ses uh, Open Sesame quest line is one of my favourites in the entire game. It's absolutely fantastic. And especially the first time you do it, it's so exciting. It's like, wow, we're actually, we're actually doing this. We're going to do a heist. It's, it's fantastic. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed that. I certainly did. <laughs> Thank you very much for joining me today. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you on the next part. Take care. Halt! You there? Please wait! You're Geralt of Rivia, are you not? Depends who's asking. Revenue and customs for occupied Tamaria, Dorian branch. Represented by yours truly. Deputy Tax Enumerator, Walter Mormite. Honored, I guess. What seems to be the problem? In brief, undeclared income. Excuse me? We've had reports, numerous, that over the last months you've come into a great deal of coin. Quickly. So quickly it's raised suspicions. I get how that might have happened. Be glad to clear them up. Profession? Witcher. Monster Slayer. Hmm. Sole proprietorship. Service sector. Type of services rendered. Rat pest monster removal. Moving on. Have you at any time engaged in the wholesale trade of rawhide in the White Orchard area? This some kind of joke? Of course not. Right. Next. During the current fiscal year, have you engaged in the acquisition of bivalves with the express intention of selling the pearls therein? Even if I have, what's wrong with that? Article 86, Section 3 of the Tax Code. Whosoever purchases goods at an unseemly low price to take advantage of the seller's ignorance shall be subject to a fine equaling 200% of the earnings from any such a transaction. Sound familiar? And now, please answer. Have you or have you not dealt in said pearls? No, never done anything of the sort. Witcher's honor. Now, for the final question. Have you ever unlawfully acquired another man's movable goods? Chattels? Hmm. Meaning? Ah, oh, a meaning. Have you ever waltzed into someone's home and taken something without their permission? Gotta be kidding. The Witcher's Code forbids it. I'm pleased to hear you abide by your guild's bylaws. Now, if you could wait for one moment, compare column B to table 7. Apply the rate for confirmed childless bachelors, a tax credit of 7.3% for practitioners of hazardous professions. It adds up to the crown. I say, good sir, you are exceptionally upstanding. It'd be rude to disagree. In these times, such civic virtue is a rarity. It must be commended. Rewarded. Here. Well, what's this? A diploma. I bestow on you the title of taxpayer in good standing. I'd suggest you frame it. Hang it in a place of honour. Congratulations. Best wares this... Type of services rendered. Rat pest monster removal. Moving on. 
Have you at any time engaged in the wholesale trade of rawhide in the White Orchard area? Might have. Once or twice. Definitely no more than three times. And did you then file a WIPT 30-slash-C form with the Revenue and Customs Office for your place of residence? No? As I thought. Hmm. Right. Next. During the current fiscal year, have you engaged in the acquisition of bivalves with the express intention of selling the pearls therein? Even if I have, what's wrong with that? Article 86, Section 3 of the Tax Code. Whosoever purchases goods at an unseemly low price to take advantage of the seller's ignorance shall be subject to a fine equaling 200% of the earnings from any such a transaction. Sound familiar? And now, please answer. Have you or have you not dealt in said pearls? Yeah, unfortunately, on occasion. But I didn't know it was illegal. Ignorantia legis non excusat, as the ancient friends would say. Ignorance of the law excuses no one. Now, for the final question. Have you ever unlawfully acquired another man's movable goods? Chattels? Hmm. Meaning? Ah, oh, a meaning. Have you ever waltzed into someone's home and taken something without their permission? A couple times, but the owners never protested. In the eyes of the law, that is no excuse, my good man. Now, if you could wait for one moment, compare column B to table 7. Apply the rate for confirmed childless bachelors, a tax credit of 7.3% for practitioners of hazardous professions, and done. Here. What's this? A summons to pay back taxes. Please report to the Vivaldi Bank with this document post haste. But... but I've never paid any taxes. Not one copper. Precisely. Yet you've had the obligation always. Thus the arrears. I advise you well. Do not treat this matter lightly. <sighs> Paper pushers. Taking a peek at my wares, she was a mage in their home, shall burn alongside him or her. Stay out of my way. Vimy, could you do me a favor? Oh, I fear not. You can't? You see, I've been told you owe back taxes. That means I cannot provide you any services till you take care of that wee fuck off. Just pay it. Jeez. Not the fault of the bad. They're going to test taxes even more.